who have experienced the horrible pain of losing a child gathered in Mobile today for a new event. Compassionate Friends of Mobile hosted the Butterfly Walk. News 5's Chad Petrie has this story. With every footstep, there's a pair of feet not here and a story to go with it. Helping other people is what Adam would have wanted me to do, and it's a way that I can still take care of him, even though he's not here. Angie, too, and members of her family are walking in memory of her son, Adam, who died nearly four years ago as part of the Dauphin Island Regatta tragedy. Two says she had to learn how to find happiness again. People who are part of this walk say one of the most important ways to continue to grow and cope in this time is to have a support group. You experience a heartache that you've never felt before and you didn't even know existed. Um, and so, you know, we just kind of lean on each other for that support because, uh, you know, we, I just don't know what I'd do without them. The tail end of the walk features rows of pictures of children who died as surviving families walk by. You will um, find joy again. You will learn to live again. It's a new normal. Your life is never the same because you're missing that piece. A reminder that you're not alone in this walk. Reporting in Mobile, Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5.